welcome to your online classes good morning students in today's class we are going to discuss lesson number 6 from your english grammar book mastering grammar under title nouns let us start well dear students first of all we have to understand what is a noun noun refers to the name of a person place animal or a thing let us understand more about nouns what we have discussed we have discussed that a noun is a name of a person place animal or a thing girl boy mom dad grandma grandpa mrs jones these are the examples of persons school home playground zoo these are the examples of place dog bee frog cow lizard these are the examples of animals book flower shoe pencils these are the examples of thing now dear students let us more understand about nouns look at these pictures and write p for persons pl for places t for things and a for animals dear students now you are having a picture of tiger now it is your turn to tell me what word i have to write for this tiger read the question again you have to write p for person now check tiger is a person no pl for places tiger is a place no tiger is not a place t for things tiger is a thing no tiger is not a thing and a for animals yes well done tiger is a an animal so we will write a here now this is a picture of ice cream ice cream is the name of a person no ice cream is the name of a place no whether it is a name of a thing yes it is the name of a thing so we will write t observe this picture this is a picture of park now check again whether it is a name of a person no park is not a name of a person park is a name of a place yes it is a name of a place so we will write p l because park is a name of a place let us observe next picture it is a picture of a doctor one more time we have to check whether doctor is the name of a place no whether it is the picture of a animal no whether it is a picture of a thing no doctor is a picture of a person yes doctor is a person so we will write p here let us solve this question on the basis of our understanding what is the question underline the nouns in the following sentences let us start first sentence ruhani goes to school now ruhani is the name of a person so it is a noun let us check goes is the name of a person place animal or a thing no to to is also not a name of a person place animal or a thing let us check school whether school is the name of a person no place yes so school will be the noun next sentence hari has a dog hari we know that hari is the name of a person so in this sentence hari is a noun let us check whether has is the name of a person no place no it is not the name of a thing or animal so it is not a noun a that is also not a noun 
Now we will check whether dog is the name of a person. No. It is name of a place. No. Is it the name of a thing? No. It is the name of an animal. So, dog is a noun. Let us move to third sentence. I have a beautiful pen. We know that student, I have a beautiful. These are not the names of a person, place, animal or a thing. And now we are going to check whether pen is the name of a person. No. Is it the name of a place? No. Is it the name of a thing? Yes. Pen is the name of a thing. So pen will be the noun in this sentence. Next sentence, Rinky has a cat. Rinky, we know that Rinky is the name of a person. So it will be a noun. Has and a, both are not the name of a person, place, animal or a thing. So these words are not a noun. Let us check whether the cat is the name of a person. No. Is it the name of a place? No. Is it the name of a thing? No. Is it the name of an animal? Yes, cat is the name of an animal. Let us check next sentence. My friend is in the library. My is not a noun. Friend. Friend is the name of a person. Yes, it is the name of a person. Is in the. These are not noun because these are not the name of any person, place, animal or a thing. Now we are going to check whether the word library is a noun or not. We have to check whether it is the name of a person. No. Is it the name of a place? Yes. Library is the name of a place. Well dear students, today we have discussed lesson number 6. Nouns from your English grammar book, Mastering Grammar. I hope this lesson is clear to everyone. We will meet in our next class. Till then, keep learning, keep growing.